can get to though, because we can't escape this area. Um, I'm sorry, man. I'm not gonna watch a video on stream, especially since I don't think there's any any energy tanks in this tiny area. Let's call them sky stamp. Like this is the worst because it locks you in this place, and there's no way to get power up or anything. Yeah, I can't break through that wall. Um... Yeah. Like, well... Yeah, they can ruin days, it's true. Yeah. Yeah, seagulls like all the food. They really like food. Well, I don't even know what an albatross is. Did you just make that up? And flamingos! Yeah, I've never actually seen a flamingo, except at the zoo. I went to the zoo the other day. They were just chilling out, minding their own business. I wonder, like, at the zoo, are the animals happy or are they just miserable sitting there and bored? I know some of the birds were not caged in at all, so they were free to fly away if they wanted to. But I guess they liked it there, enough to chill out and hang out with the other animals. A mouse cursor, yes! Showing everything. Like, how perfect do you have to be? It's a seagull, but with super huge wings, really? That's cool. It's like a king of seagulls. That's pretty nice. Okay. Like, if they're- so, I have a question for you, LP Gamer 9000. Do you know either- first of all, is there any way to get power bombs? And second of all, is there any way to get out of this, like, tiny little piece of space that I've been stuck in because I saved? Like, cause this really sucks. This is literally Winds of Me stuff now. They migrate across oceans. Really? A nine foot wingspan? That's crazy. That's so cool though. Like, what could be better than that? Like, what could be better than a regular seagull? A giant seagull. There were seagulls in James and the Giant Peach. And they blew the giant piece over the place. Yeah. Let's go. Oh, I went roller skating as an adult recently. It's so cool. Like, it was kind of strange because it's like, it's me and my like four other mid 20s aged friends. And. We were the only ones there. There were like a couple teenagers, and then everyone else there was like 10. But it's like, it's okay. We want to roller skate, so we can roller skate. I felt maybe a little bit out of place, but I still had a ton of fun. Like, cause I never knew how to roller skate as a kid. And I was still really bad at it. And then, I don't know, I had a ton of fun. And then I realized, like, if you held hands with other people, it makes it a lot easier to keep balance. But then it also makes it, like, you can throw off their balance. So it was really funny. It's like mutually assured destruction. Like, it makes both people more balanced. But it's also much riskier if one person loses. Well, I mean, I guess you'd let go, but... It was really fun. Because I had very little control. Wreck. Wreck, wreck, wreck. I recommend roller skating to everyone. Don't do ice skating. Ice skating just sounds dangerous and scary. Explain a South African accent. I think if you say... If you say beer can... In a Jamaican accent, it sounds like bacon. Like you say, bacon. Or maybe it's the other way around. Maybe if you, if you say bacon. I don't know. There's something about saying bacon 
in a Jamaican accent, and it sounds like beer can. There we go. Ice skating is awesome. I've never went ice skating. Yeah, I think there might actually be a video. I know my friend made a video of me roller skating. I'll see if I can find it, and if I can, then I'll post it up for you guys. Because that would be super hilarious. Of me trying to roller skate. <laughs> no, I already did! I, I, will, I can totally do a Jamaican accent. Video eyes. You will take me ice skating, okay. If you can actually teach me how to ice skate like a pro and not just like fall on my feet. I actually learned how to roller skate kind of decently. If I can roller skate, maybe I can ice skate too, but it seems a lot more unsafe. I don't know, you never played the game itself. You only looked at gameplay. Because we're like stuck. See, I'll, I'll be more a little bit more thorough with the problem. There's no way to escape. And we need, apparently, power bombs help a lot, but the only things, if I kill enemies, there's zero ways to get power bombs. Usually, there's an eye door that will give you full everything before a boss. There's no eye door this time, so you're just stuck with what you have. Which means I have no power bar. Milo! What is up, Miss Milo? Welcome to the stream. Glad to see you here. Glad you are with us. You guys, if you not are not following Milo, definitely follow Milo. She is, like, my biggest inspiration for streaming. She is super, super awesome. She started playing Portal 2 recently. She got a new computer. And she's, like, super awesome. Milo, we're trying to fight this really, 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 really hard boss. It's not going super well. Um. But we're maybe gonna beat it, or maybe we're just gonna die here all day. I don't know. Milo. Yeah, Milo is awesome. You and your words. Follow the deer. Yes, follow the deer. She is awesome. Yeah, I just, you had to get two of your plushies. Oh, dude, Dark Shadow J! I still need to see your plushie collection and see what all the plushie is about. I've heard, I heard you talking about it the other day. I was gonna pop into your stream and be like, dude, reposition that webcam, but you didn't have your webcam on. I didn't want to ask you to turn it on just to show. I want to see your collection of all your anime things. Let's go. Go, go, go. As long as, people, as, long as you don't fall on your face. Oh, sorry. I missed a lot of chat because my life stopped me. It's fun. Even when you're not going to fall. Oh, you fall on your face when you're ice skating, Milo! Wow. Okay. Maybe I won't feel so alone if I do go ice skating and I fail horribly and get wrecked. Wait a minute, cutting people? You mean cutting people with, like, your skates? How would that happen? If you kick them, maybe? That does not sound like something that could happen by accident at all. So we can, there's a collection called the Lone Future State. Maybe? It's super cool. Detailed buildings, lore, that's awesome! Okay, maybe I will check it out. Maybe I will stream it. I really, 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 really like Portal 2. Like, I have to say, my favorite. Portal 2 is probably my third favorite game of all time. Because there's like unlimited content potential in that game. My fourth favorite would probably be like Fallout 3. Don't flail your feet in me. Why would you? That sounds like a... My usual reaction to falling is not to stick my feet out into the air. 
Portal 2 is amazing! I completely agree. But if you know how to roll a blade, it can make it easier. I barely know how to roll a blade. I was failing pretty bad when I tried the last time. Your dad steals swords in the kitchen. Was sharpened recently. What? Why was he sharpening it? Is this like a horror movie? Like, yeah, it's like Final Destination. Ice skating's easier than rollerblading, but you don't know which one you did first. Me neither. No, wait, I know exactly which one I did first. I actually did ice skating first when I was in, like, kindergarten. And I was so bad at it. I just, like, clung to the wall. And then, in retrospect, it's like, why would you take kindergarten level kids to an ice skating ring? Like, ice skating is not an easy skill to have. I don't know. That was pretty strange in retrospect. Gives you 20. Yeah, but the problem is that we can't get out of this area, so we can't get more power ups. At all. Yeah. <laughs> Ice skating. Why not? Ice skating is for all ages. Yeah, but it's a hard skill to learn. Like, it's not easy. And what's up, Dyro? Welcome to the stream, Mr. Dyro. Glad you are here. Yes, you can definitely give me a tip. I am open to tips, hints, help of all kinds. Because we've been stuck on this. Oh, it's, oh, it's for the walls. I knew it. Well, that explains it. It was the teachers who were like, ha ha ha, we want to watch these cute kids just run around this ice skating rink and fall a bunch. Ha 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 ha, they might not enjoy it, but we sure will. That's probably exactly what they were saying. I know you were like, oh gee, <laughs> there we go. Dang it. Give him any tips. I will take any tips at all. All tips. Because they are massively, massively appreciated. You can... In the... Well, the thing is... Here's the problem, Dyro. We don't have any power bombs. There are... There's zero ways to get power bombs. There's no recharge rooms. No matter how many enemies we kill, we can't... We just cannot... Get any. Enemies don't drop power bombs. So that's the problem. Like I wasted all my power bombs exploring. And now we have none left. Then use morph ball bomb, really? That doesn't work. Is that the one you were talking about? Oh, dang it. Why didn't anyone tell me this? Well, thank you so much for letting me know about that. I could have been stuck here for years. I literally thought we were going to be stuck here for years. Oh, well, I guess we're not beating this game today. But thank you so much for the tip. I had no idea. Dang it. Everyone kept saying power bomb. But apparently you can do it with regular ones. Too. Warning. Oh, well, there's actually a glitch with the emulator where you can't shoot diagonally with missiles. I don't know why, it's a really weird glitch, but I can shoot diagonally with regular weapons, but as soon as I switch to missiles, it points it straight again. Well, let's not rule anything. <laughs> exactly. No, I really was going to be stuck here for years. Like, it would be like, alright, 2017, still fighting this boss. I gotta figure out how to cling on. Like, man, why did... Man, now I'm fighting with the control. Oh wait, so how do I... Oh, so once I cling on, I don't have to worry about anything. We died a lot to this poor guy. There we go. We're good, we're good. Yeah, how to cling on, yeah. Well, we figured out how to cling on. 
The I heard that actual books were translated into Klingon. Like, can you imagine that? When you play certain games, it helps keep your frame rate a bit higher. With resource intensive games. Oh, okay, I understand. That is cool. Huh? Alright, let's go. Oh, you know what sucks? When I was a kid, I was actually really, really bad when I was in elementary school. I actually was, like, banned from the coolest field trip of, of the year, which was going to Disney Quest. I still don't know what it is, but supposedly it was, like, a theme park where you can make your own roller coaster or something, but it's, like, digital. It's like a video game arcade theme park roller coaster thing. I don't know if it still exists, but it sounded, like, insanely fun. But then I couldn't go because I was a really bad kid, and they D permitted me from going. It's like, you freaking jerks. I was so annoyed. And then in middle school and afterwards, I was a really good person. I was banned. Oh, what I did was, um, I was really bad on some other field trip. It was at like some music concert. I think I kept talking during it probably. I don't know. I just caused general havoc. I got an in-school suspension like three times in middle school. No, wait, not in middle school. No, I didn't do anything wrong in middle school. In elementary school. For like the dumbest thing. Like teachers accused me of lying. And just like general tomfoolery. Just like little things that would add up. Like not one individual thing. And then the teacher would just blow it out of poor portion. Because it's like, okay, even though you haven't done anything insanely bad. You really deserve this. Alright, if you say so. I can punk. Triple J, what's up, man? How are you doing? Hope your arm's doing better. Yeah, let's go. Alright. We're losing health, but at least we're making progress. No. No! Come on, come on, come on! Okay, we a really bad period. Not entirely sure I have- No, I'm pretty sure I have that. I'm not bad anymore. I'm just lazy these days. You did enjoy that. No, I didn't! I'm lying. You got suspended for lying. No, here's the thing. I was like super adamant. My teacher would be like, you did this. And I'd be like, no, I didn't. You were wrong. And then they'd be like, are you calling me a liar? Like, I'm not calling you a liar, you're just wrong. And then they'd be like, alright. You need to learn a lesson. It's like, you don't understand. People say don't talk back. I think that's dumb. I thought that was dumb as a kid. I still think it's dumb. If I've got something to say, then I'm gonna respond. I'm not just gonna blindly listen to authority figures. What am I crazy? I don't care who it is. Suspended multiple times for swearing. I never got suspended for that. Oh, and I had a knife necklace? And I got suspended for that one. No, in school. I only got in school suspension. Which were so crazy. Like, I wish I would have gotten full suspensions instead. Full suspension, you get to go home. In school suspension, you have to sit there bored all day. He's calling you wrong! Exactly! I mean, I think they are completely different. A knife necklace, yeah. And my teacher was like, you can wear it, just keep it underneath your shirt. He's like, okay. And then of course I didn't listen. Cause it's like, what's the point of a necklace if people can't see it? I was. <laughs> I really was. Still am! <laughs> Alright. No. Ink on the goal. On the gun. Oh no, we're gonna die! I watched that movie, The Shawshank Redemption. I thought it was really lame. It was supposed to be super good. I hope we can beat this boss in like the next 15 minutes or so. He sure is a tough one. Dang it! Oh yeah. 
Dang it, Michael! <laughs> Why? Why do you say these things? It's not a giggle. It's a it's a deep seated evil laugh. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's how I'll laugh in the future to show people how hardcore I am. Like, I take over. I'm time to split conqueror of worlds. Read the book. You don't like my opinion? Well, then you are wrong. I don't know, I was really adamant. Like, I would not let people say something if I knew they were wrong. Without knowing that they were wrong. Like, I argued with my parents all the time about really dumb things. Like, semantics. See you later, man! Thank you so much for helping out today. The backseating was greatly appreciated, dude. Glad you were here with us. Glad you were able to stop by. Later, LP Gamer over 9,000! Okay. Take out the missiles. Fire my own back at him! Let's just charge up our beam, actually. This is. Okay, take this guy out! Oh man, my seems like a little bit too short. Like that bottom one always hits me. Come on, beam! Yeah, the bottom one is always gonna hit me. And then I keep falling down! That would be scarier and more badass! Awesome! Wrecked! Is he dead? Is he dead? Oh, don't tell me. No. No, 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 no. No! Why? Why? That was super unfortunate. GG. And we would have pun days! Yes! Pun days instead of Sundays. You are so right, Tasso. Not GG. Not GG. That is like the worst. What time is it? Is time passing slow? Wow, it's only 3.41. Okay. So we do have time to keep fighting this guy. We can do it! Yes! You are so right! We never give up. We keep trying forever. Even though my thought it was GG. It's actually not GG at all! <laughs> that's okay. I don't mind losing because that just means we get to spend more time showing out with this good guy. And maybe he's just misunderstood. He's not evil. He just, he just uh, wants a friend. He's just been stuck up here all alone for such a long time. Look at how broken and bruised he is. He looks like he's had a pretty tough day. Oh, you know, Milo, you have to play this game. It's so good. It's really fun. Yeah, let's go, 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 go. Run! You guys, I said it earlier, I'm gonna say it again. My two favorite streamers were here today. Make sure you're following them both. Um, and I, I feel kind of guilty saying it's my favorite because like, every, like everyone's stream. Like Mr. Shadows and um, who else is here? Tasso! And like you guys are all the best, but. Okay, maybe I shouldn't say, I take that back. I don't have a favorite. But I do really, 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 really like um, Milo and Daikon. And, well, okay, everyone. Okay, I should stop talking because it's really, I don't know. I feel guilty saying I have favorites. But I guess everyone has a favorite of something. I know other people's favorites. Rockman's favorites are, I think Steffi Pies is favorite. Please don't be offended if I said you are not my favorite. Okay, everyone is my favorite. Dang it. I feel like I'm digging myself deeper in a hole. Dang it! We're trying to kill him. It's too late. I know! I know it was too late to see him. 
too late. And Stack! Stack is awesome too! Oh, okay. I'm just calling out everyone that I see right now. No! He's broken and bruised. Yeah, I keep firing my weapons at this poor guy, kicking him when he's down. Dang. No one is a favorite. No! Artaxian! What is up, Artaxian? Glad you are here, Mr. Artaxian! How are you doing? Just change the subject. Talk about the weather! <laughs> okay, casual small talk to avoid awkward conversation. Got it. I actually love awkward conversation. It's like my super secret weakness. I think like awkward conversation is super cool. As long as it's my kind of awkward. If there's certain awkwards that I really don't like. But... If it's awkward conversation as in like, this doesn't really fit. Like questions that people... Like why would you ask that? Those are the questions that I consider good awkward topics. You aren't actually make good at- I'm not! Dang it! I try so hard sometimes to be like... Let's learn some- because basically, in my opinion, conversations get awkward when you're talking about things that it's like forbidden knowledge. Like, I want the forbidden knowledge. I like knowing things. Right now! I try so hard to make conversations awkward sometimes. And they're like, nope, I was just answering your question. Yes, I do have the gravity suit. We're having... Daikon! Yes, Daikon is here. Daikon and Milo is here. Follow them both. Well, follow everyone, first of all. Right. But I guess it's too late now. The cat's out of the bag. Milo and um, Dai are my favorites. And I'm sorry that I have. Thank you for the host, official Daikon! I appreciate that, man. There we go. And Mr. Speaking of streams, when are you gonna stream again? You have such a good voice for streaming. Or just a mountain thing. You could be a, a narrator. Or you could do audiobooks. That would be a good profession for you. Yes, you are of course my favorite mod. Although Stig is pretty cool too. You work so long. Yeah, I understand. This guy's slowly getting wrecked. Yeah, oh man, I want to make custom emotes now. I don't know if you guys have heard, but with better Twitch TV? Yes, he's... Okay. So we're not... This is not actually G. We got a run. We got a runner. Yay! Thank you for the host, Milo! I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Dang, dang, dang. Yeah. Yes! Yes! Wave beam. It penetrates like none other. Awesome. This is super good. You can make a business doing this. That's awesome. But yeah, using better Twitch TV, you can get custom emotes, even if you're not partnered. So like, Daikon has a custom emote that's his own face, but a Kappa face. Um, I want to get ones like a monkey Kappa. Wow, nice. Yeah, we actually did. Take a screenshot of time. When the time is right. Okay, and then we'll turn that into a Kappa face. That sounds perfect. Let's see. Oh, good call, good call. Ova! Yes! We defeated the boss! That took more tries than anything. Okay. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Wrong link. 
Oh no, what did you link us to? Should I be horrified? Should I never ever click that? This is a terrible thing you linked us to. I'm afraid. Alright. Now where do we go with the wave thing? Oh, we can go deep. Let's go deep down this hole. And um, then there's the do room I couldn't even get through yet. This wave beam is so freaking cool. Warning, no entry without authorization. You're only on, yeah. And it's cool because it's gonna like make everyone have better Twitch TV now. No, no one would want you gone by. <laughs> what is this area? Restricted laboratory? Don't get it. There's so many flashing lights, I'm afraid. Oh, and we got power bombs back. And the door's locked behind me. There's clearly something going wrong. Kellen Frank Kill! What is up? Welcome! Thank you for the host! I appreciate that so much! The SAX is dying! What's going on? 60 seconds to get out. I need to get out. I didn't save yet, did I? I really hope I don't die. That would be horrible. This could be very, very bad. The threat is real. Oh, did I get out? Or did it blow up? I really hope I got out. Hello! Nice to out right now. What is up? Good to see you. Dollars are hype! Yeah, they are. Get here forever. <laughs> awesome. As you can see, the Federation has been secret. Well, I won't read out the story just in case anyone happens to be playing this game. And this is like end story moment. And the story is really, really compelling for this game if you haven't played it before. Now it gets Athena Gamer! What is up, Athena Gamer? Good to see you here. Glad you are with us, Athena. How are you? Welcome. What's up? We are approaching the very, very, very end. The plan was to beat this game today, but clearly that's not going to happen. Um. We're gonna have to beat it tomorrow, and then we'll play some other game tomorrow. I see actually reading dialogue. I'm actually not reading this dialogue. I started out reading the dialogue, but that's okay. We can skip some of it. Hello, hello. So we're trying to beat the game. Yes, you did. You did see the word sexual. It was talking about, I think, disexual reproduction of some virus, the X virus. No, it was probably something else. They're probably secretly making some X rated videos behind the scenes. That's what that computer is for. No, it's actually about the X virus and stuff. That, the X virus is this thing. It's actually really cool. It basically like animates anything, so that's like how the that's why there's so many creatures about board the ship because the virus got on and like it can animate literally anything. It's so crazy, and that's why when you kill something, it moves like your health moves. Because yeah, I know you love the X. <laughs> um, because when you kill it, oh, we can't get out here. I want to leave. When you kill it, it's still alive. And then you collect the X-Virus, and that's your health. So that's why your health moves from you. I was messing with you. Yeah, I know. You were hyped for the X-rated videos, but they actually are not. But it would explain why that secret computer is always being so secret. Close your eyes. Red. I don't think Red's even here. Keep it up. <laughs> what? What are we talking about? You haven't been on Spanish exam. Got it, yeah, because you got an E in Spanish. Why are you getting an E in your grade? Well, let's... Let's go. Apparently, we've got things to do in X-rated videos. 
go, let's go. Dang. Oh, come on! Go, go. I don't think- wait a minute, I could defuse these guys, actually. Boom! I missed an energy container? Am I supposed to go back? I'm not- I can't imagine I'm supposed to go back, am I? There's probably an energy container up here. Oh! Oh, there it is. I don't know where I'm supposed to go, though. Oh, wait, we want to charge up our missile and shoot it up. Yay! Alright, so where to from here? We've got another, like, 10 minutes before I gotta call it a day. Can we even go back down? Oh, I can, can't I? We're in sector one. Where does this elevator take us? We want to like get back to like the ship or something. This takes us to mystery land, restricted zone. Well, that doesn't sound safe. Let's get out of here then. In Metroid Prime, there were like big, big elevators that took out like this. Basically, this elevator in Metroid Prime would actually be a loading screen for the next area. And I thought that was like really clever. That they like masked the loading screen so that you never noticed like that they actually had to take time to load the area. Which like why doesn't every game do that? Where the loading screen can have to area? Go back down to the room with the locked doors. You mean up? The room with the locked doors was up. The enemy. Kill the enemy. We will. We will kill. Kill the enemy. That is our plan. Yeah. Let's go, dude. Yeah, we are. Okay, out of here. And save. Did I save yet? I'm pretty sure I saved. If not, well then, oh well. Ooh, a golden guy. Oh, are these like the ones in Super Metroid where you have to shoot them in the back or something? Yeah, you do. Hey, he's dead. Those ones were way easier than the ones in Super Metroid 2. Save! Yes. But well, we already saved, I'm pretty sure. We'll probably be fine. And here's another save room, so we can save again. Extra safety. Just for that added layer of protection. We got it. Not the back, just for the charge beam. Oh, really? Okay. More rooms! Empty room. Probably stuff in here. But I don't want to run into like a situation where I'm out of power bombs again. Is there stuff back here? Cool. What's down here? Oh, Ridley? Hello, old friend. What's up, man? This is the nice thing about having a million missiles, when you can just spam them. Die, Ridley, die! At least he doesn't have any invincibility frames. Famous last words, yeah. You know me too well. I hate so much losing progress! Charge beam will do all the work. Yeah, okay, so we don't need missiles at all. But it's just so much fun to just like spam missiles. It is shrieking in pain, but that's what we must do to the base. Damn it. Oh no, what's going on? Did it freeze?
Did the video freeze? No. Wait, I think it's loading. I see video loading. Nope, offline. Dang it! No. Well, this sucks. 